What's going on everyone? KM Dolph back for the next installment of South Park the Fractured But Whole. Welcome to the next episode in this Let's Play series everybody. As you may recall in the last episode we fought a lot of people. We went to the skew and we met with Mr. Mackey from Kern. Today we're venturing over to the church to go and visit Father Maxi and if we get time we'll also be going to Freeman's Tacos to go and get the Keen, his much beloved taco. So guys, stay tuned for today's episode, and we'll be right back after I've queued the intro. And we are back after that amazing intro as always. Now, getting straight into it, let's go and look at the map. We are there. We need to get to there. I reckon we can walk up here to get there. So it'll be nice and quick. So let's try and do that. Do, 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 do. I did get everything from here last time. Yes, I did. Ah, look at that. There's a little... Oh, what's this? Uh-oh. We've walked into trouble already. No, nope, can't even talk to that person. Oh, hello. A new fast pass. Beautiful. Now, I see something down back there. There's a bag. Let's go get the bag. Beautiful. More crafting materials. Nothing behind there. We can't get in there. That's fine. Oh, look. It's the church. Let's go to the church. Well, hello, new child. I haven't seen you before. But you've come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Someone's stealing our cats. They're TPing houses. Not the TP. Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the hard sell, but do you see yourself as a good person? Well, I can understand the confusion, but there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus and take the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. Interesting. Take the first step, my child, by entering this meditative chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest fears. Face your fears, new child. Face your fears. Now, I've got no control over that. I'm just walking in there, and he just shut the door on me. Well, that's weird. Your dad, fuck your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Moo. Oh, hey. I'm in your imagination. Just a friendly Catholic priest who would like to get to know you a little better. Yeah, yeah that's right. I'm totally in your imagination, too. About to give you a shoulder rub. Ever imagine you no! like this? No! Let me adjust the lighting in here a bit so we can get some visuals with that. Jesus. Okay. Well, I guess this Fun times. No complaints here. Alright. These enemies use telegraphed attacks indicated by red striped squares on the combat grid. Okay. Let's just dismiss this because I don't really care that much. Okay. Let's start by... Bumping these two into each other. There oh, you go. Like that. Yep, you would like that, you weirdos. God's grace is totally filling me. Okay, I'm ready to fill your vessel. Oh! Stop it, you two! You sick Whoa, that freaks! Is a whole lot. You don't want to get caught in his hook. You might really need a towel there. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting out of there. Because the good thing is, if I can use this attack. Mm, good. Ah, oh uh, bleh. Come out, come out wherever you are. This is so bad. No. Oh, yeah, he is risen, all right. Okay. I should be able to attack him now. Boom. 
Oh my! All right, I'm outside of everyone's red zones. Oh no! I've got God's love here. Who am I gonna give it to? Oh Jesus, that's so gross. I'm full of God's grace and nowhere to put it. Oh, it's so yuck. Can't stand that. All right, one down. Here, little kitty, come out and play. Ah, oh, stop it! It's so bad. That is so horrendous. All right, let's just end this guy's miserable existence. Huh? Spank me! Oh, what? How's he not dead? All of God's children are deserving of His love, so just hold still. Ah, oh, it is so gross. All right, end it. Thank God for that. That's so gross. Ew. Oh, I've got a heavenly suit and heavenly gloves. I do need to look at a new costume. I think that would be kind of cool. So we might have to look into that. New artifact slot? Yes! Let's get another artifact out. God damn it! I can't put a child in a dark room for two minutes without you bastards showing up. Well, you're definitely going to hell now. Get out of here! That's not what the Queen Spider says. I'll go say 10 Mel Harry's. Well, gosh, I feel just awful about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble and tribulation, use it to call upon the prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey, my child. So the Catholics are giving me macaroni pictures from the Jews. Yeah, right, okay. That's just... Yeah, right. Okay. Sick bickies. You've received your first summon. During combat, access the items menu and use the macaroni pictures to summon Moses. Awesome. So that's locked. Is there anything that I can sort of uh, pinch from in here? Yes. Father Maxi's office. Are there drawers? Stuff that I can take. Right. Okay. Steeple. Church. Splash down log ride. Kneel before Jesus. Okay. Church storage room passcode. Haha, -ha, kneel before Jesus is the password. Cool. I just picked up a holy Bible. God damn it. Nothing there. Okay. Nothing else there. Alright, we've got to get out of here. Can I get back in there? Ah, uh, what was it? Kneel before Jesus, wasn't it? Kneel. Neil. Before Jesus. Excellent. All right, we're back in here. All right, let's pinch some stuff so quickly. Amulet of Contemplation. Nice. Let's be very careful in here. We're not going to make sure that we find all the right gear. Okay. Don't steal. I just stole. Is that holy water? Can I... No, can't do anything with that. Okay. Ah! Oh, Yowie picture! Yes! I love those! What is that up there? Is that a... No, there's nothing else there. Okay, nothing else over that side of the room that I missed. If I miss anything, I'll be very peeved. What's with those hearts everywhere? There's like, those big glimmering hearts. Do they mean anything? I don't think they do. Alright, let's get out of here. The Lord giveth and the Lord taketh a selfie. How about it? Alright, let's take a, th take a, th a selfie. <laughs> there you go. Photo with Father Maxi. Love it. Bless you, new child. Bless you, new child. Oh. Remember berries. Remember when Morgan Freeman was God? Oh yeah, I remember. Remember when Christians cared about the sick and the poor? Sure, I remember. 
Oh, there's also a bag here. Awesome. Okay, nothing else in there. Just double check everything before we get out of the bag. See, this is why you check things. Antidote. That'll be handy later on. Perfect. Alright. So that's the church done. Now, let's go through here. Nothing over there. Sorry again for what happened, you kid. I'll keep an eye out for those guys. Sweet. Quesadilla stuff. I don't know what any of that means. Okay, now. We need a map. We need the map. Okay. Uh, where's the taco place? Where is Freeman's Tacos? All the way along there. So I've literally got to walk that whole distance. Wonderful. Let us let us do that promptly. Let's just start walking. Hopefully we'll find some stuff along the way. Like that. Bonus. Now there are policemen back here. I don't know what that means. Are they there for any particular reason? Oh, it's because it's a police station. Can't talk to him. Can't talk to her. I'm not going to go into the police station today. I'll do that in another episode. Let's just keep walking. Walking, walking, walking. Another bag. Take all the things that we can. Take that, both of you. Now, can I get back? How do I get back there? You meet some colorful characters when you live two miles above sea level. That's wonderful. All right, let's follow this little path and get that bag back there. Come here, mine. City hall. I assume we'll have to go there eventually and talk to the mayor. I just saw the community board. There is a yowie there. Wonder where that other one's gonna be. Let's go, kitties. I got porn to watch. Uh, we're not going to the park. Hey there, shaman bud. You can use your snapping pots to ignite things like fireworks. Give it a try. Okay, that's great. Unplanned Parenthood. We've been there already. I still can't get up there Are yet. Are you having fun yet, cutie? Come find out. No, leave me I alone. You like beating up girls. I do. In that way that I don't. Tom's Rhino Plastery. Oh, hang on. This is a. Oh no. Damn. Need to get somewhere. You kid. I love it how he's not actually that fast, but they make out that he is. <laughs> You'll never get in here, super fool. Shut up. What are you doing? Working hard or hardly working, kid. Okay. Baggy there. I'll just quickly check over here, make sure there's nothing I've missed. There's stuff up there that I can't get to. I'll have to go to these two places eventually, which I will do. Let's go to Freeman's Tacos. Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. If there's anything I can interest you in, well, you just let me know. <laughs> Morgan Freeman! Greatest. Greatest man that ever lived. I love this place because you can craft whatever food items you want. <laughs> All right, let's quickly uh, harass the... T I knew there's a reason we went to the bathrooms first. There's all the Yowie pictures. I dropped a cash reward with your mum. She said she'll put it in your room. Enjoy, TTYL. All right, let's quickly do this challenge. All right, let's do this. Beautiful. Sweet. Ah. Good. That'll do. Let's get it done. Sweet. Um, okay. F, V, and Y. Sweet. Level 4 toilet. My ass. Haha. <laughs> 
Alright, oh, that's that done. Let's go back out and get ourselves a taco. We like us some tacos. Alright. Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. Freeman's Tacos is completely craft your own. You know what crafting is, don't you? Just open up that crafting menu and we can get started. Open your phone with tab. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Let's start with a staple, the burrito. A warm tortilla wrapped around, well, any old something. Here, I'll give you what you need to get started. This here shows how much food you need to fill up that tortilla. Okay. Now to just put it all together. Well done, kid. Now that you've got your first taste of crafting, let's dig in. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Go ahead. See what happens if you combine a burrito and an enchilada. Congratulations, new kid. With an enchilada and a burrito, you've crafted an enchirito. That's the first time anyone's ever done that. And what the hell? That <laughs> guy's clapping. More recipes. <laughs> they might just save your stupid ass. Okay. Nothing left to do now but document this moment in human history with a selfie. I do want a nice big happy... There we go. Morgan Freeman. Yes. Okay, let's never do that again. Thank you. Got some new stuff today. Get it while it's hot. Oh, okay. So he's actually got stuff we can buy. That's pretty cool. Okay, so I've got $21 at the moment. So... You can buy tortillas, you can buy guacamole, sticks, bag of fritas. I should probably buy that flask of orgasmic power because it gives me... That ought to get some juices flowing. Good, let's go with that. That's all components and that's artifacts. Okay, so that's all he's got there. Come back anytime, during business hours, I mean. Okay, thank you. I don't know why you kids need to create your own social network and the whole town buys into it. Oh. Oops, wrong button. The Curly Sanchez. Hey. Alright. Well, that's that. We've got the taco. And just one more thing. Oh. They say that some farts are so powerful they can actually bend the fabric of time. You be careful out there. New kid, you've done a decent job so far. Come back to the coon layer. I think we should advance your character. Coon out. Alright. Guys, what I'll do is I'm going to cut from here to the coon's place so that we can save a bit of time. So I'll see you guys at the coon lair. Okay. And we are back. We're just about to enter the coon lair to find out what the hell Eric wants. Fuck. You. Mom. Very good. Alright, let's go down and let's talk to... Artifacts are a big part of what makes you strong, bud. It's a good idea to try and match your artifacts with the kinds of powers you use in battle. See you next tip. All right, well, how's it going out there? Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm going to upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. Mad. I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um, your character sucks, to be honest, and... I think I'm going to let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Oh. Elementalist. Storms always brewing with elementalist around. Shock and chill foes. Buff friends. Keep your local humidity an ideal 40. Cyborg. Cyborg. Prime directive is to kick ass. Mastering the battlefield with powerful pull and knockback moves. Psychic. Late night infomercials have weaponized the psychic's mind, granting the power to fortify teammates and debilitize enemies. So yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. Okay. Elementalist. Blaster. I'm cyborg. keen. I'm keen to go with the cyborg. Let's go cyborg. A cyborg. Robot fetish, huh? That's cute. Ooh yeah. Okay, I think those two will work nicely together. 
But now we're gonna need to change your backstory, too. So let's go back again to that fateful night, back when you were little. You did lay awake that night, but the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. Now we're gonna have to do this crap again. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. I suppose I have to go to the door. Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power. Power surged through your cybernetic appendages as you focused on your prime directive. Protect the baby that, for some reason, was loitering in your hallway. <laughs> hey, what are you doing here, kid? But little did the intruders know that you weren't just any kid. You had been cybernetically enhanced with a suite of shocking abilities. Demonstrated the first of these abilities on your victim. Hey, you can't just knock him back like that. Yeah, what gives? Hey, wait up. The charge you left on the bruiser ah. shocked to his allies, damaging all of them at once. But you still had many more cybernetic tricks up your sleeve. <laughs> huh? Yeah, I'm so enraged right now. Oh, sweet. So I got a blocking Somebody ability as well. That's pretty cool. Shit. The intruder took a swing at you, but your block absorbed the damage. Bonus. I'm, I'm so pissed. Thugs tried to keep their distance, but they weren't prepared for your next power. What the hell did that even do? even work sweet laid into you it was time to bring out the big guns that's sick oh, man, yeah, that's sick. <laughs> that's insane More machine than man <laughs> and so you beat them you swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe and then that's when the unthinkable happened so my dad fucked my mom again? Fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you couldn't stop your mom from being fucked by your dad. <laughs> That's heavy, man. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Cooning friends alert. Cooning friends alert. Seriously, guys. Alert. Alert. It's a cooning friends alert. This is Coon. What's happening? It's the Freedom Pal. What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! Powers installed. Open tab with your phone. You have four power slots. Use blah 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 and blah 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 to select a power to replace... When you finished equipping powers, press tab to exit. I don't need a knockback. I'll definitely pull that one in, I think. Yeah. Because that still causes damage. Yep. Alright, let's go with that. When you finish, press tab. Cool. Alright. So what we will do... Is I'll call this episode off here. I'm not going to go and fight people on Main Street just yet. We will wait until the next episode for that to happen. Because before then, I will also change costume. So at the beginning of the next episode, we'll change costume. Then we'll go out with the coon to go and fight people on Main Street. So guys, thank you very much for watching today's episode. Uh, make sure you leave a like. If I missed anything during my travels that you saw that I should have seen but missed, make sure you leave a comment and let me know. And guys, we will see you for the next installment of South Park The Fractured Butthole. Thanks guys, and I'll see you next time.